Or it was a big budget film for our, um, you know, the way we used to work. Like, for example, Lobster or the other films were about 4 million euros of sterling. That was about 17, 20. It was a studio film. You know, we knew that uh, people from the studio would come and we would want to watch and, and everything. It was a bit strange situation. I was working on the Sacred Deer and it had a lot of work to be done in the post-production. But then Lanthimos could not continue working because he had the contract to start working on the favorite. He, so he was not allowed to do anything else. So I had to stay behind and finish the film, all the post-production, the sound design and everything, about three months. So I didn't start the favorite. I came very late. Then I went to the States. I, I worked with Alejandro for Monos. Mm -hmm. Already Lanthimos had started working. And uh, I got into to, to the favorite already. There was an edit when when I it was my first different collaboration with Lanthimos because usually you know I get the script and, and I do the assembly and everything. I knew nothing about the favorite. I didn't know the script. I didn't know anything. I was just presented with a cut and with music in that as well. And uh, that that was um, you know interpreted in, in, in means of the script, the, the edit that I saw, which was, it's a normal situation. And, uh, and then Lantmos needed me to come to try to give it a different, like, you know, direction or to make it uh, a Lanthimos film and not, you know, any film. And we played around a lot with the, with the structure of this film. We broke down the... Uh, this is another method we usually do, we usually follow. We do, we do construct the film according to the script, or as the, the way we understand the script, but then we like to deconstruct it, to, to, to play around. Most of the times you, you do feel the need to do it, but some other times you say, okay, okay, this is good. But what about if we do that? So he gives me the time, to, the time to try something different. And then slowly by immersing yourself in the film, you get to know the core of the film. So from a descriptive film, which was a plot oriented film, okay? A plot mean, meaning that Abigail, you know, the young girl, yeah. Uh, comes to the palace and she becomes uh, the instrument of all these changes. Now we changed this premise because he wanted to, to, to mainly from that film is to, to, to talk on or discuss with us, with the viewers, the meaning of love. So a lot of things had to change. What is love according to what person, to what extremes he goes to achieve what he believes is love. So everything becomes like a thesis.